What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Chatting with the Cholo, where I will continue to be your heavily tattooed host, the Cholo. Today, Mrs. Cholo isn't going to be here. Uh, she's a little preoccupied with some things, so I'm going to take over the series. I'm just making a special guest appearance on my own channel. Uh, tonight, I'm going to be jumping back in time to retro react to some of Amberlynn Reed's earlier videos. I will be going in order from where Mrs. Cholo left off at. Let's extend a finger to point and laugh alongside me at one of the worst pedophilic, narcissistic, partner, and animal abusing, lying buttholes that has ever waddled the earth. And real quick, don't forget to become a looked out Cholo just like myself through my official channel memberships. All the cool kids are doing it. Probably should too. Let's get back to the video. All right, guys, here we are with rainy weather and pork curls. I've set up a little playlist so we can just run through some of these uh, uploads of Ambers in order and bang them on out. Let's jump on into it. Hot pork curls. They're actually really, really good. I love pork rinds. If you've never had these before, pork rinds or pork curls, you should give them a try. You're just the type that likes to eat, but that's Amber though. I mean, she just, she loves to stuff her face. They are not diet friendly, but everything in moderation. Bitch, you can't do anything in moderation. That is the key you need to live by because it's not a diet. It's a lifestyle change. Shut up. That would be Ringo trying to get attention. Sitting on Crystal while Crystal's trying to play rock band. Or surprise, surprise. Look at her. Watch, pet the back of her. I hate judging Crystal because she never wanted her life blasted on the internet, so we shouldn't judge her. But Crystal, my God, girl, you have got to go outside. Put the fucking Guitar Hero down. She puts her butt up. Aw, Ringo's. Tell everybody hi. Tell everybody hi. I'm so wet for. Or far something so wet. Uh, Gross, dude. I honestly love when it rains outside in the winter. I love dark skies like that. Because then it gives you an excuse to be inside. Like, oh, I can't go outside. It, it's really cold and rainy and the weather's shitty. Because when it's summertime and you spend all day long inside the house, you just look like a fat, lazy lush. When it's cold outside, you at least have an excuse to look like a fat, lazy lush. I just don't like when it rains in the summer here because then there's tornadoes and thunder and lightning and scary stuff like that. But I love fall and winter rain. It's so pretty. It just makes me so happy. This is the part of the video where I want to say a very special shout out and a giant thank you to my channel members, Pink Panda, Acetone, and Christian EC. Your guys' support is more than noticed and appreciated. Thank you all and back to the video. Hey guys, real quick, I want to take a second to give a very special shout out to a friend of mine from over on Instagram. If you guys don't follow me there, what the fuck is your problem? Go follow me. I post my weight loss, my memes, post tattoos, uh, you know, shit that I'm interested in. And of course, EDC gear, aka pocket knives, expensive titanium pry bars, uh, pocket art, just, just expensive pocket art. I found a dope little standard quarter inch open-ended wrench. A creator over on Instagram had turned it into a pry bar. I loved it. I thought it was really cool. So I messaged her. Unfortunately, she is no longer making them. So I'm bummed out, but you know, it is what it is. So whatever. And what does she do? She asked for my address and she ships me this. I know it's it's not a whole lot it's nothing crazy but it's a very cool little piece i'm really into pry bars pocket knives like i said and this was just so cool and unique and uh, it, it's just a cool little piece i i really wanted one and like i said what does she do she she's not making them anymore so she gets my address and ships this bad boy to me it arrived at my house about two days ago so miss amy bell this is the biggest fattest shout out i could come up with Thank you, my friend, so very, very much for sending this on over to me. It was such a very kind, sweet gesture, and I will not soon forget it. I can assure you of that. Amy, again, 
thank you. You've made a friend for life with me. And I hope, you know, if there's ever anything that I can do or anything for you, please reach out and let me know. You got one in the bank if you ever need it. Thank you guys for your patience and let's get back to this video. If you guys saw the faces my girlfriend makes, you'd be speechless. She's quite the funny character, trust me on that one. Right side, like Dude, always. She's quite the funny character, trust me on that one. We've seen Crystal, we've met her, a character she is not. She's a pet rock that's come to life. That That's how exciting Crystal is. Left side, like always. But look down here. Smokes, is that you? At my feet. Aww. The only one that's missing is Ringo. Where she goes. I'm like a little fuzzball on the side of the couch that makes faces when I was in my early 20s. It was cool to quote your friends and the dumbass things that they would say. And then you could post it up like, this is my inside joke that nobody else will understand. Just stop it. Just stop it. You're embarrassing yourself. O-M-G. Look at this. That's a pork curl and it legit looks like a- Dude, look at her fingers. You can see all the little crumbs and grease. Ew. Dude, she's so fucking gross. A scorpion. Whoa. Oh. Sorry. I get amused by the most random things. That's because you have the brain of a child. This is my dog drinking doggy chicken broth because he's- also, it was cool back then to say random. Like, oh my god, guys, I'm so random. I say random things at the mall. Random. It wasn't cool. It's somehow significantly more awful when Amber does the things that that hot girls used to do. Just saying. Sick. Aww. That's okay. Oh, I'm sorry. It's just a camera. All right, guys, you did make it to the end of that. And now we're going to jump on into Vlogmas 1, 2013. Here we go. Hi, everyone. You guys ever noticed the way she does the editing on her videos? It is the most basic, primitive editing she could possibly do. Amber's videos today look the way that they did a decade ago. And so, I'm in the middle of... Ugh, she's looking rough. And look at that hair. It looks so greasy and just, ew. Doing my makeup. Is... Yeah. <laughs> Still have my pajamas on and everything else. Um, today yeah, is the first sprung. day of Vlogmas. Um, I haven't quite figured out... Um how um, i'm going to be doing my vlogmas i know everyone does it different some people vlog um, and just talk to the camera some people um, vlog their whole day um, um so i don't know we'll see how this goes um, um i'm just excited yay <laughs> but um yeah i just um, wanted to say that i'm getting ready for the day i'm going grocery shopping so I'll see you after I'm done getting ready. And I will keep my hair like this because I'm feeling too lazy to do anything else to it. Even though I have all this craziness going on, but oh well. So, makeup's done, I got my earrings in. Just black flowers today. Hair is still a mess, but I don't care today. And just a shirt that goes- Do you ever care? It seems like you never care about your physical appearance. I mean, I know you don't because, you know, you're 700 pounds. To the side this is a shirt as well not my bra just saying <laughs> but yeah so my makeup's very not as drastic as normal i'm just feeling kind of slouchy and bleh you're not gonna do your big stupid little wings over here they why does she do that because they don't look good and if we're gonna be completely honest with one another here i'm talking to you guys audience let's be honest right now the way that amberlynn does her makeup the way that amberlynn dresses it's trailer trash and I'm not saying that living in a trailer is trashy, because it, it's fine. I used to live in a trailer. My point is, you can live in a trailer and be perfectly normal. Or, 
you can live in a trailer and embrace that shit. You can embrace being one of the trailer park boys. If you know, you know. Probably from all the Thanksgiving food that we've been eating. Shame, shame, shame. I love my shame, purse shame, so much. Shame. I'm gonna do a what's in my purse video one day. Cause I'm sure that's just so entertaining. It's not. We wrote on the walls. Dude. Why are you writing on Crystal's walls? What the fuck is wrong with you? You're a child. Yeah. Seriously? I, I didn't do that shit when I was 14 with my first girlfriend. Who the fuck does that in their 20s? That for Crystal. Before I even moved here, I drew that for her and I sent it to her. I'm not at a very good angle, but yeah. That's a masterpiece there. Looks like shit. Joking. Trying to debate, should I or should I not wear the scarf? I'm just going grocery shopping, that's all. Uh, choices. See, and that's the type to get dressed up and wear this stupid scarf thing to go buy our fucking groceries for the week. Choices. Uh, so this is Crystal's purse. We're in the car while her dad is getting gas and she wanted me to show you her purse. Doubt it. It's by Betsy. How come we never ever hear Crystal or Beck or Destiny or any of these other partners that Amber's been with? Why don't we ever hear them on camera saying, Ooh, show them my my new phone, show them my new shoes, so show them my new purse because they didn't want it. Amber, you're the one that wants to show this dumb bullshit because you have no real content to share with your audience. Johnson. I'd wear such a thing. I think it's cute. I'd wear such a thing. So we just got out of the store. I tried to be more healthy, so. You're I right. think I did. I think I did. Okay, now Crystal's dad's coming back, so bye! last day of eating whatever I want before tomorrow. Yum. Why does she always have to give herself one last day of eating? One last cheat meal? Like, dude, just stop. You gonna eat it? You gonna eat it? It's a piece of chicken. Are you gonna eat it? No. You gonna eat it? Dude, don't put that greasy shit right on the carpet. What the fuck, Amber? That's not your house. Stop wrecking it. Fuck. I guess she doesn't want it. <laughs> She's staring at Charlie. Charlie's. Do you want the chicken? Are you gonna eat it? Of course he does. Whoops. He ate it. Heaven. So good. So I'm currently on my laptop and Charlie is following me everywhere. Look at him. Gross, dude. Mm -hmm. Get that fucking thing down. <laughs> Charlie's. He's up on the table. Which is disgusting, dude. Get your animals off the tables. You eat there. It's gross. Why are you being so cute? She's not. Put your socks on or I'll kick it. That's twice now I've seen Amber put Jamesy on her Facebook. You know, the angle said this in one of his videos that Amber, Amber might be a lesbian, but she definitely likes to entertain men. You can, you definitely can get that from her. It's, it's fucking weird. I am so bad today. I cannot help myself. Like I said, today is the last day. Dude, that shut I up. I will be messing up. I'm gonna eat some of this, and yeah. It is so good. That sounds disgusting. Pumpkin cheesecake? Yeah.
I'm watching Desperate Housewives. And she's cooking a pot roast, pouring some wine. Yeah, don't ask. Obsessed with this show. Thank you, Netflix. <laughs> what is with the fucking slow motion replay? It's on the stupidest shit. All that rant from her doing a slow motion thing. See, it's easy to get off topic with this bitch. So this is the ending of Vlogmas Day 1. Um, oh, wow. I guess this is how I'm going to do my Vlogmas. I'm just going to um, film a bunch of random things throughout my day. Are and you? Upload it at night. Um, so the same way you do all your videos, you're going to record stupid bullshit, put it together and upload I hope everyone had a great day, first day of December. This is my favorite month by far because of Christmas, the weather, my birthday. But um, yeah, just a great month and let's see if I can stick to, I'm looking at my girlfriend, that's why I keep going like that. Anyways. Who else would you be looking at? Dude, you're never around anybody but Crystal. That's all you guys do is just this is YouTube dickheads all the time. It's fucking disgusting. It's sickening. Why? Why, dude? Get some alone time. You need it. Let's see if I can stick to um, vlogging every day for 25 days. The last day will be December 25th. That'll be Vlogmas Day 25. But who knows? I might even continue it. We'll see. So, anyways, if you aren't smiling, smile. Bye. I bet you're putting on weight within a week. Guys, you made it to the end of that one. Let's go ahead and jump on into our next one. Okay, guys, this is December 2nd, 2013. Weigh in plus goals for this week. Here we go. Hi, everyone. So here is my weigh-in video. Um, so um, first, I'm going to talk to you about my last week's goals and then my weigh-in. And then this week's goals. And on top of that, I'm going to... um actually change my weigh-in schedule so um we're gonna talk about Three. that too so last week i said that i wanted to eat 1700 calories every day without going over i said that i wanted to be down three pounds and that i want to do my squat challenge every single day now i'm going to tell you if i succeeded in those things or if i didn't and why pretty much um um for the 1700 calorie thing four? i did not succeed in that at all um the first night I couldn't even do it. It was, it was pathetic. I have to say that it's pathetic. I cannot count calories. It's just bitch. You're pathetic. Not. It's just so overwhelming. I I don't know. It's not. It's not overwhelming. You are overthinking it. Oh, just something about it. I just cannot do it. So I did not complete that goal. Squat challenge every single day. I started. Oh, I hate her freaking mouth noises. Oh my god. My squat challenge, and I expected to finish it but i had to stop i did post a video about it um um five it has to do with my back if you haven't seen that video i'll post it down below for you to watch um so just click on the um, link six and if you have watched that video then you understand why i could not follow through on my squats which i want to do so badly i'm sure you all know that by now yeah next totally. thing am i down three pounds from last week last week i weighed in at 368.0 um seven i did not come close to losing three pounds this week has been my most indulgent binging week i have ever had i want to blame it on thanksgiving i want to blame it on the food that was in this house i want to blame it on all sorts of things but the only person i can really blame it on is me i put the food on the floor Good for you my mouth. it's that simple it is that simple completely i mean it's my fault Dude, you know what? I genuinely hope that you do not succeed. I hope you can never make it on a diet. I hope that life gives you the karma that you absolutely deserve. You pedophilic piece of shit. So, I weighed in today and I was actually up three pounds. I weighed in at 371.0. Good. Good. I can't even believe. I can't even fathom. I can't even express. I can't even... I'm shocked that I'm in the 370s again. Raise your hands out there in the audience. Yeah, you guys, raise your hands out there if any of you are shocked that Amber put on weight. Any of you motherfuckers, raise your hand. Yeah, that's what I thought. That bitch. 
but I shouldn't be so shocked, right? I knew it was going to happen. I've been messing up on my diet very badly. I don't know what is wrong with me. Yeah, it's just, it's not okay. It's not okay. But in total, I'm still down 49 pounds. I need to look at the positive. I'm proud of myself for that. But I'm not proud at all the weight I have gained. And I need to get a hold on myself. Um, Self. It's just not good. It's not good. It's just my not God. a good look, especially for my channel. My you guys are watching me thinking, is this girl going to be losing weight? I come in and weigh in and I never lose weight. It's not okay. I need to. Why would you lose weight? You said yourself, this isn't a weight loss channel. Get my stuff together. Not only for myself, but for people that need to be motivated. I want to be able to motivate other people. I have lost so much weight in the past. I don't know what has been wrong with me in this last year. No, you haven't. You lied about 89 pounds. You are a gluttonous waste of space. It's kind of pathetic in the whole resolution yeah, thing, but I'm you excited for 2014 to come along because I feel like that's going to be, as people say, my year is so cliche. I know, but. So cliche. Like, is that I what she like said? As people pollution thing, but I'm excited for 2014 to come along because I feel like that's going to be, as people say, my year is so cliche. I know. So cliche. Wow, she's really stupid. But I feel like I feel like things might happen in 2014, and that's all that matters is as long as I feel that. But I want to get a jump what? start. So um, I've made myself some more goals for this week. Um, goals. But first, actually, I want to talk to you guys about my weigh-in schedule. I normally weigh in every single Monday, but that's right after the weekend. The weekend is always the hardest for me, like extremely hard. And lately I've been thinking, why not weigh in? towards the end of the week before the weekend just so I can get a real good idea of what I did lose instead of gain, like losing and then potentially gaining over the weekend and then it doesn't show that I lost if that makes sense so and I have been thinking about that and then my friend tweeted me saying why don't you change your weigh-in schedule and I just thought it was meant to be it was meant to happen so I will be weighing on Thursdays now also you don't have any fucking friends nobody texted you suggesting this bullshit it was fucking trolls you dumb heifer of gain like losing and then potentially gaining over the weekend and then it doesn't show that I lost if that makes sense so and I have been thinking about that and then my friend tweeted me saying why don't you change your weigh-in schedule and I just thought it was meant to be it was meant to happen so I will be weighing on Thursdays now I am doing my Monday weigh-in today obviously but I will be weighing in this Thursday and by this Thursday I hope to be down Whoa. three pounds it should be simple for someone should be considering I can cut six in less than what 75 80 minutes in a nice warm bath you can't lose three over three days on my size it should be very very simple um some of you might look at that as are you sure that's healthy but I'm sure it is for someone. It's my healthy. Way, I should be asking. Am I sure it's healthy to be this big? If you know, and I'm not. So if I can lose the weight fast, I'm gonna lose the weight fast. And um, um, she seems really self-aware in this one. It's weird. It's weird how much she really seems to know what's going on. Cause I, I thought she was far more mentally disabled than this. She clearly is. Maybe she's just a little more capable than I'm giving her credit for. Cause she, cause she's definitely on that short bus. I have one other goal. Goal. Um, since I can't do squats, I can't really exercise right now. I'm going to skip out on the exercising this week. Yes, you so can, you fat bitch. Next week, I will. I will be doing some sort of exercising, and I'll tell you guys about that. I will. I will. But this week, I wrote down on paper, don't eat. You know what, guys? I can work out this week, so I'm going to work out twice every single day. And I'm going to go run a couple miles every day on top of it, because I can. I don't say I can't. Amber, it's all just, I will. I will. You guys, you'll see. I'm going to. And there's never any action behind it. I hate you so much, Amber. Anything that'll make you feel guilty. That is my goal. I will not be counting calories because I can lose weight without counting calories. I'm really grateful for that because counting calories does not agree with me. I've done Weight Watchers and that doesn't agree with me. I just can't do it. I can, um, eat intuitively i'm bad at saying that word so i know i said it wrong but i can eat like that and still lose weight and that's what i plan on doing so by thursday i hope i hope i hope and i pray that i'm down three pounds if it's more thank you if it's less then at least i lost something i will not let myself gain any more weight i just won't i just can't let it happen i just can't can't so i'm down 49 pounds in total um i'm doing no you're not um nine circumstances even though that's probably just a major excuse for my weight gain but whatever 
So I hope to weigh in on Thursday and show you guys that I was able to be down three pounds in just these few days and I really, really need to do it for myself. I just, I do. So thank you for watching my weigh in. Um, Ken. I hope you guys are having a good day. If you weighed in today, I hope you're having a great weigh in. If not, you can, this is a new week. Um, 11. So thank you for watching. And if you aren't, smile, smile. Bye. All righty, guys, we made it to the end of that one. Thank you so very much. We're going to jump into why do bad things happen to good people plus silly cats? I don't know why bad things happen to good people, but Amber, I don't think you need, ever need to worry about that because you're a piece of shit. I kind of have a feeling that you're going to deserve everything that you get coming towards you. So my girlfriend and I are like obsessed with Netflix, but we seem to prefer it coming in the mail because it's more exciting because well, that's so weird that everything they do we prefer it coming in the mail because we get excited because we like to enjoy this because we it's always we they think off of a hive mind mentality they can't have or they're incapable of independent thought we have so many things cued to come that we forget what we're getting so currently just yeah, like you, Crystal told. said. Just like you. So, so Crystal's saying that Amber orders so much bullshit on Crystal and Crystal's parents' dime that she forgets what she's getting. Season two, disc one. We have Married with Children, season two, disc two, and the Water Boy. We both have seen the Water Boy, but I don't even remember what happens up in it. We both. Oh. She does. I've seen it like a million times. She's seen it a million times. I'm not sure if you can hear her, so that's why I'm saying that. But yeah. Just kind of wanted to show that. And we've legit have had these DVDs for like months. Like we go on sprees where we cannot stop watching them. And then we go on sprees where we can't, we don't watch any at all. It's like really weird. <laughs> You mean you have phases where you enjoy consuming media and phases where you don't? Wow, that's so crazy, Amber. Holy shit. But yeah, so I just kind of wanted to share the three Netflixes we have. Maybe I can start um, every time we get a new Netflix, I could be like, okay, this is the new Netflix we have. I don't know. Oh, but, wow, Amber. Yeah, wow. If you don't have a Netflix, you definitely should. <laughs> 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 Oh, don't cuss on camera. Oh, what? It's about fucking time Crystal show a little personality on camera. So let her say whatever she wants. Shut up, Amber. Shut the fuck up. He's now the old man is playing. You get it, Charles. You get it. You got it. Wow. Now I want to find whoever did this Photoshop and see what I'd look like if I was skinny. Dang. So this is a completely different Amy's TV dinner that I talked about before. This one has vegetables, rice, dal, I have no idea. But it's pretty much just organic vegetables and rice and OMG. It is so good. How many calories is this one? Okay, it's not wanting to zoom, but it's 310 calories and it's really good. I love Amy's TV dinners. So far, every single one I've had has been really good. And just Again, I think that's just a sign that you like to eat. Most people don't enjoy every single dish that's put in front of them like that. You know what? Now that I think about it, it's pretty rare that Amber says she dislikes anything. You know, I'll have to, sh I'll find it and I'll put it in the video right here for you guys to see it so you can see the page. But there's a page on Instagram and this dude does the greatest impressions of Amber. Her mannerisms are so spot on. Fuck. I'll, I'll make sure I link it right here so you guys can see. But dude's funny. Go check him out. Just coming from my girlfriend's mouth, her favorite is the pesto pasta if you want to try that one too. My Charlie is so fat and cute that he literally lays down to drink his water. You wish somebody would say that about you, but truth be told, you're just fat in the way and a nuisance. What is that? Isn't he the cutest thing? You just want to cuddle with him in bed? Oh, this, huh. He is so cute. But look how lazy he is. We're currently watching Grown Ups, if I was to recommend any comedy movie to anybody, it would be this movie right here. Is anybody surprised that Amberlynn Reed's type of comedy is 2012 Adam Sandler? Anybody shocked by that? 
So I'm just being a good person and drinking my water. I'm gonna use my little thing. I opened my thing, which kind of was hard to do. And then I don't know what happened, but that part that is supposed to be like around here came off on here and it can't come off and now I can't close my water. <sighs> Why do bad things happen to good people? That wasn't a bad thing and you're not a good people. All right, guys, good job. You made it to the end of that one. Let's go ahead and jump on into Miley Cyrus plus more of my girlfriend. Wow. So, this is the kind of hair that you need to be afraid of. Yep. I'm officially afraid. What are you afraid of, Biggie? What is that? Just a plastic bag, dude? You're letting your animals play with plastic bags. Ew! Gross. Ugh. Oh my god. I saw Amber's paws. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Why are her feet so fucking deformed? You guys know that it's your fault I'm watching this shit. I watch this stuff so that we can make these Let's Watch Togethers and I can upload them for y'all to enjoy. And maybe we can share in some of this mental misery. But I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of starting to resent you guys for making me watch this shit. Like watching Chris can be hard. Watching Cyrax can get difficult. But fuck, I feel like I'm getting dumber watching Amber. Oh my god, I, I'm gonna start mispronouncing my words real soon, and I'm, I'm not gonna be no gooder at talking. And <laughs> that's you don't know what you're doing. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god, the instant replay. Uh. What is Miley Cyrus and a cat? That's stupid. them staring at her eating friskies you guys already had some smoky you already had yours silly cats dude do you just put all the food right there on crystal's carpet for the cats to eat like that so the grease and the crumbs are just on the carpet and then you guys walk through the house in your bare feet you guys are the greatest audience in the world and i love you guys i love you also very very much you guys are my vatos. Hey guys, real quick. If you're not following me over on Instagram, what the fuck is your problem? Go follow me on Instagram. Back to the video. I hope, I pray that none of you treat your homes like this. I hope and I pray that you guys take your shoes off at the front door. This is shit that cavemen do. She's a morbidly obese, a lesbian cave woman. Say hi. <laughs> Why is there is nothing behind those eyes, and there is just a whole lot of stupid behind those eyes. I'm sorry, Crystal. This is no hate towards you, but my goodness, girl, the time you and Amber spent sitting in your bedroom doing nothing. It is the most mind-numbing, inane bullshit. Say hi. <laughs> Why is she so shy? See, that... For the way Crystal's acting there, she doesn't really strike me as the type that was like, Amber, show them my purse. Show them my purse. Show the audience my purse. Show the audience of 300 subscribers that took you three fucking years to get my purse. There was a llama at the Christmas tree farm today who reminded me of Ringo. Cool, what a cool inside joke, Amber. That's so cool. You're so you're such a unique and quirky girl. Girly pop. Girly pop. Ringo sleeping. All right, guys, you made it to the end of that one. I appreciate you. Let's get into Vlogmas number two, 2013. Here we go. Hello, everybody. 
so today's vlogmas day two i'm just about to get something to eat um yeah i have to give my animals something to eat you guys hungry Dude, honestly, it's not going to hurt any of those animals to go on a little diet. They could all stand to lose a few pounds. It's fucked up, but it's true. I have to take Monkey out. I don't know if you can see him. Okay. So, that's that. So, stick around to see more of my vlogmas. I was about to say bye, but I realized I'm going to have more to film. Yeah, that was weird. You couldn't just edit this it out? This light right here for my girlfriend is the light of hell because you know what that means. He's trying to tell you. <laughs> that means she has to put them away because dis dishes are her job. But I'll help her, of course. You'll help my ass. My ass, dude. We all know you're not helping do shit. We've seen it so many times. James and Wanda have to leave the vacuum out. To remind you heifers to vacuum when you get up at 3 in the afternoon. Who are you fucking trying to fool here? Your help. Suck my dick. So, Ugh. I made this for my girlfriend and I to eat. It's potatoes, pesto, and a little bit of bacon bits. I honestly can put pesto on anything. Besides desserts. But who knows? It might be good too. Looks like red I love pesto. It's like one of my favorite things. So Looks like red rabbit Just kind of wanted to show you what I made. <laughs> so this is my plate. I already ate one potato and it is delicious. My girlfriend cut hers all up and I wanted to interview her. No, not really. What, did I you eat them whole? The taste. Good. <laughs> Tastes good. Would you ever want to eat this again? Dude, let her eat. Yeah. She's being shy. Behind camera, she's... Dude, she's trying to eat dinner. Fuck off and let her eat. Jesus. She's jumping up and down how delicious it is. <laughs> no, I'm joking. No, but it's really good. It's just little baby potatoes, pesto, you know, regular pesto, and then some of those. Honestly, try this. It's a good breakfast. Even though we wake up really late. Breakfast. I'll have to explain that in a whole other thing because I'm making this vlog already it's long. And all I'm oh. doing is talking about food. <laughs> but yeah, it's really good. And yeah, I recommend it. So right now, me and my girlfriend are cleaning our bathroom and She's bringing this down to the downstairs bathroom. Cherry blossom soap. There's a reason for this, trust me. Yeah. <laughs> She's bringing this one. <laughs> Coconut and warm ginger down to the kitchen because we do wash our hands in the kitchen, obviously. And you know, she tells me, she goes, Coconut Kitchen. That'd be a cute restaurant name. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was cute and funny. Anyways. You guys ever notice that Amber has that, like, it's a very distinctive laugh. It's always these big women from the trailer park. You know the type. They wear flip-flops and the sides of their feet have like dirt and it like kind of goes like this where it goes under the heel. And on top of it, you know they're walking through their house like that. And that's who Amber's laugh reminds me of. I'm gonna go back to cleaning, I guess. Mm -hmm. He does not like the camera. He was legit just staring at me, looking at me, jumping on me. Now look at him. You're intimidating, dude. You're scaring him. Monkey. Oh my god. He hates the camera. Oh my no, god. No, he, he hates looking you. Looking at me. That is pathetic. Monkey. You're pathetic. Look. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's He's a good boy. Horrible. Why don't you look at the a camera? handsome boy? Look at how sad he looks when the camera's on his face. So get it out of his <laughs> oh face. God, that is so funny. Oh, there he goes. Say hi. Say hi. Oh, he's a boy. He's <laughs> a good boy. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, love you too. I hear him snorting. That's his way of saying, I love you. Don't lick. Yeah, good boy, don't lick. Yeah, I don't let him lick me because we all know where his tongue goes. <laughs> Hot monk. <laughs> Bitch, we all know where you... Tell him bye. Tell him bye. What about where your tongue goes, you fat heifer? What about where your nasty feet have walked across and now you walk in that shit across these people's beautiful carpet? What about that, Amber? What about that? 
Tom Bay. Bye, monkey. <laughs> he, he, he makes he makes there me less mad. There you go. So this is where we keep the um, cat food and dog food. Oh shit! In our downstairs wow. Downstairs bathroom, which is next to the kitchen. Um, and that's their treats. But I just came in here because I'm feeding them to get monkey his food. Cats their food. This was not open. I come back. Or my girlfriend says something, I don't remember. And she goes, why'd you open the mirror? And I'm like, what are you talking about? I didn't open the mirror. So yeah, just saying, if we have a ghost, it better not show itself. I'm just saying. Just saying. That's the garage door. And Monkey knows somebody's home, so he sits there and waits. So this is dinner. I made broccoli in the oven. That right. stuff is that's good. This cheese, pepper, and I, I like it to be very peppery because it does give a good flavor. Mm -hmm. and peppery. Some, a little bit of pesto I put in there, just like the tiniest little bit, and it helped a lot. This is just brown rice. I put salsa in it and some hot sauce that we use called Cholulu. Cholula? And just the tiniest bit of this cheese too. And that is a tamale. It's a processed food tamale, yes, it was frozen. Only took three minutes to warm up, but who cares? I'm doing better. I made myself broccoli. Even though Why is it always the, the white women that say, I'm going to have a tamale or a taco enchilada. If it's me, I'm going to have a tamale. I'm just kidding. I say those same fucking things too. I'm going to have me a tamale. Uh, uh, lots of pepper and a little bit of pesto, but it helps with the flavor. So I just kind of wanted to show this and I'm not counting calories like I said, but. It irritates me that I can hear her fucking mouth noises. Like, knock it off! But if I was, all this is probably about 400 calories. And that's not bad at all for a dinner. So, yeah. What are you doing? <laughs> dude, dude, <laughs> boots in the house. Gross. He follows everybody up the stairs. That's what Smokey does when someone's doing the dishes because he likes the bubbles. Huh, Smokey? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Is this what she does? Like, this is all day for her. Just sit in the house, talk to the animals, point out the things that they're doing with their lives and things that they enjoy, and just film herself going from room to room. So this is the end of my vlogmas day two. What was so funny right there? Are you just that fucking tickled that you had a question get read on somebody's video? I have questions get read and live stream all the time. That that's part of the fun in participating. I'm in a live stream right now. Are you guys into ghost and paranormal live streams or am I a fucking dork? Because I feel like it's really, really cool. Um, I know there's so many animal clips in this one, but <laughs> So this is the end of my vlogmas day two. Um, I know there's so many animal clips in this one, but You just can't help but film your animals when they're so cute I mean, I'm sure people who are animal lovers will understand that one But if you're not an animal lover, I hope you are becoming one from watching my videos And if you watch this video all the way through, I thank you and um I just really enjoy making these vlogs, even though, I mean, I don't know if you'd consider them boring, per se. Yeah, but, they're boring. 
I just hope you guys enjoy them. That's all that matters. That's why I'm making them because not only is my videos are way more exciting than yours and even still mine are boring as fuck. The fun, but I like when you guys watch them and I like when you guys comment and like and subscribe and all that. Like when the, when the numbers go up, I get happy because it's it's kind of like showing me that you like what I'm doing. You like what I'm doing to my channel and you want to follow me and everything else. And not only are you following me, but you're following my girlfriend, even though she doesn't really show herself that much. And you're also following my animals, clearly. <laughs> if somebody follows you, they're following the whole family. Earlier in the video, I said her and Crystal have like a hive mind situation type deal going on there. And it, it just, it makes it so more and more evident. Like, everything is we. It's weird. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, so um, I hope everyone's having a great December 2nd, and I'm posting this at night, so I hope your December 2nd was good, and just, I'll see you guys tomorrow, of course, and I also want to mention that the reason why I have random vlogs going up that have nothing to do with vlogmas is because I do, I have filmed stuff like in the past week or so, and they are still on my phone, so I just kind of like to randomly upload those. I don't know. It's just fun to do. So that's what I've been doing. And that's why random ones have been going up as well. So yeah. So just thank you for watching. And if you aren't smiling, smile. Bye. My God, that was awful. You guys are thugs. If you're still here, let's jump into the next one. It's a shorty short. It's asking Amberlynn. Here we go. Hi everyone. Um, so I wanted to kind of film like a question and answer video. And I think I'm going to call it asking Amberlynn. So in the comments down below, ask me anything you want there is nothing off limits i will answer every single question in my comments um i'm not sure how long i'll wait to answer them but um i guess i'll just wait until there's a lot of questions or if nobody asks me anything then i guess i won't film it but ask me so as many big. as you want ask me anything you want um i'm just really excited to do this so please 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 comment down below and ask me whatever you want um don't be afraid <laughs> Alright, so um, this will be called Asking Amberlynn, and I'm probably going to make a few of these videos, so, but for right now, please, please, please comment down below and ask me anything. I hope you're having a good day, and if you're not smiling, smile. Bye. Good job, guys. You made it to the end of that stupid shit. Here we go with Vlogmas 3, 2013. You guys are still here riding this shit out. Good for you. You guys are thugs. I'm trying to make up for Mrs. Cholo not being in this video by making it long as fuck. Yeah, I'm starting to get run through the ringer here, but here we go. Let's get into it. See, it's just a picture of her scrolling upward. Hello, everybody. Basic Today template. Today is day three of Vlogmas, and here I am. So doing amateurish. It again. So that's good. So I just woke up and having breakfast. This is what I'm having: oatmeal with a half a banana, and it is the special K nourish. I love this oatmeal. It is pretty tasty, I'm gonna say. And this is like the only way I'll eat a banana is if it's in oatmeal or cereal because honestly I don't care for bananas at all. But if you want to see the rest of my day, continue watching this video. Dude, he's so fat. Oh my god. Oh, and guess what? I weighed in today. But you mm -hmm. don't get to know what that is. But if I continue on this track... I will be well over three pounds down by Thursday, so let's see how it goes. Doubt it. So this is what Crystal and I have been doing. Our water, whichever one we choose of this. I told her to choose me one because we have so many now and she chose grape. So put it in, close it, shake it, and then I do a taste test. I feel like I need a little bit more. So I put a little bit more. Do the same thing as I would have. Of course you do. Try it. Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't use as much as Crystal and her mom, but that's all right. Now I come over to the freezer. Bitch, are you throwing shade? I don't use as much as Crystal and her mom do. Bitch, look at you. Looks like you do. Uh Sorry, this is like the most worst angle in the world, I'm sure. The <laughs> most worst angle in the world, says the writer. Fail. That was a fail. 
the most worst angle in the world coming from someone who's a writer look at her face right here dude jesus you can see the just nasty behind her eyes and also the vast vast amounts of stupid she's so dumb so dumb fail camera right there <laughs> you are a fail yeah i come over right. to the freezer and i place this puppy in there i don't know if you can see it i'm like a worse smoky and Ew. i leave that in there for however long to take and it gets slushy and it tastes kind of like a slurpy in a way and it's very good actually i prefer drinking it like that it's very but yeah, good that's just a little tidbit on my life sounds very fucking fat i don't know why i show you the most random things <laughs> you know i get the slushy thing i do that shit with with my sodas or with my juices or whatever it's palm if you guys ever do it with uh with wild cherry capri sun get them slushy Ooh, baby are they good oh my goodness oh boy i'm sure you can tell i changed my makeup style because i did i was having major I no clue. like ocd with the other style i was doing i kind of felt like it was uneven and <sighs> that's just how i normally get and then i change it and yeah so i just did something more casual and bland so yeah what were you just doing why don't you like my camera? Because it he intimidates him. He's <laughs> so sweet. See, now my drink is kind of slushy. Is it time to eat? Hmm. Can I? Is it time to eat? <laughs> if you are wondering what was on Monkey's plate, it's dog food. Yep. And we usually mix pumpkin. Like, pumpkin from a can inside of it because it's good for the dog and it helps with his digestive yeah so i know what was on the plate looks kind of gross but he loves it and it's good for him so i just want to say that <laughs> why are you always under my blinky <laughs> so crystal's mom just called and asked if she wanted us to stop and get something to eat and normally that means something that's going to rank up Crystal's mom called and asked if she wanted us to stop and get something to eat. That would imply that you're going to be the one to go get dinner for Crystal's mom for once. That you guys will get off your fat asses and go do something for your for their parents that, you know, work and provide. Right? You know you said that, right? Dumb bitch. Up to like a thousand calories because I don't know how to make healthy choices when it comes to fast food. That's going to start happening down the line. So, oh instead, I'm going to make Crystal and I... A nice scrumptious salad. So this is what I plan on doing with it. I'm gonna put baby scrumptious spinach, a little bit of rotisserie seasoned chicken breast, a little bit of carrots, some cheese, a little bit of an apple, bacon bits, and this what? new balsamic vinaigrette dressing. And balsamic. I'll tell you guys how it comes out. Um, whoopsie daisies, I forgot to tell you, I'm also adding a few almonds, roasted salted by Blue Diamond, my favorite. These chins. Be careful. Yes, please don't hurt yourself. Take care. Enjoy Sometimes she careful. is unintentionally <laughs> funny. Why did I think I'm going to hurt myself tonight all of a sudden? Because you're out there with me. <laughs> oh, Monk. <laughs> Go get it. Charlie. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Go get it. Charlie. <laughs> Enough with the instant replays. Oh, that was funny.
Jesus. So, <laughs> I'm trying to film. No, I'm joking. Okay, so while we were trying to eat, or I'm trying not to trying film. to eat, that doesn't even make sense. While we were eating our salads that I made, um, her my... parents were eating at the table with us. And Crystal had a little moment of uh, shyness, which is pretty typical for her. So she didn't want to talk on the camera, but I'm going to ask her now without showing her. How did you like the salad I made? <laughs> I'm not showing you. I didn't show you, I swear. It was literally, it was your hair. I always show your hair. You have a little glimpse you of- You just <laughs> stop showing her. Can you please tell her how beautiful she is and she's just hiding from the world? No, I'm joking. Crystal, how'd you like the salad? I'm not gonna lie to her. Huh? <laughs> no shade but thought. Look at Smokey looking at you. I'm cackling in it now. No, what'd you think? Ooh, called out Amber for the cackling. Oh, look at that one. That's another good thumbnail. See, she liked it. It was good. One day, you will see a lot more of this honey child because let me tell you, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Anyways, oh, You're trying to get her Charlie on the wants to play. camera there. <laughs> now there's smokes. Anyways, I seem to film too much animal, I think. I film too much of the animals. Yeah, you do. Stop covering up your Anyways, microphone. Not sure what to say now. The salad was a success. That word's always hard to say. Well, it is a salad, <laughs> so. If you want to so. try the salad, you definitely should, because it was, like, legit the best salad I've ever made, and I've made lots of salads in my life. Which is really, really good. And I know each and every one of you would like it, too, because it was delicious. And it really wasn't that many calories, since I wasn't even putting a serving of everything. And me and my girlfriend split everything, so it really wasn't even that many calories. I wasn't counting, but I'm good at guesstimating. That's what I'm, like, known for. And if I had to guesstimate, it was probably, what? like, 300 calories for a lot. So, maybe even... Look at this! Do what you were doing. I'm not going to show you. Legit, do what you were doing. You're known for guesstimating? That's you. her <laughs> saying I'm talking too much. There you are. Oh, God. Am I? Okay. Well... Bye for now. I hear a very strange uh, noise. Hate you. <laughs> Coming from over here. Why do I always forget what light it is? Monkey? What is this? Monkey chewing on a cat toy. That is not the first time. Shame, shame, shame. Well, Look dude, get him some dog toys. <laughs> No, I'm gonna have to put this up here because you can't be eating on that. Okay? <gasps> oh, that's a legit, a sad doggy there. <laughs> Aw, tell everyone you are loved, babies. Yes, you are. Aw, see, he loves me. I love you too. Mini snack before my next meal. Haha, uh -huh, smart thinking. Are my videos boring? I always get so worried about that. Not to me. I love watching them. Seeing you and your sense of humor act makes me so happy. Exclamation point. Nobody talks like that, Amber. That, this is retorted. I said it last video in, in the Cyrex video that we're taking the word back and I meant it. Amber, this is retarded. Really surprised actually someone who never talks on the phone. Uh -huh, yeah, sorry. Oh, yeah. uh -huh, sorry, that was too funny. Yes, I hate talking on the phone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what <am I> <laughs> <laughs> you always sound the same every time. Oh, it's funny. I'm not expecting it. Okay, so I think I'm going to end my vlog day three here. Hope that wasn't too boring for you, but I don't really leave the house. I don't have the means to do so, so. My girlfriend's sitting next to me. Do you want to see what she's doing? Do you want to see her? I'm joking, she won't let me. Not really. She's. Why is my phone blinking? What in the hell is that? He doesn't know. It blinks whenever it's facing you. But she's playing some app. I don't even know. I just botched this whole recording because my thing was blinking. 
I think I videotaped too much. Do they even call it videotape? No, it's recording, dickhead. No, nobody calls it videotaping. It is recording. You know this. You've used that word hundreds of times. Also, your face right there, it's very, very ugly. Okay, we wrapped that one. This will be our last one. It's our last couple minutes here, and we are through. Thank you for hitting to the end of that one, and this is Bitstrip iTunes Girlfriend. And this is going to be our last, uh, last segment for this video here. This is our last little stretch. Let's get into it. was Charlie snoring. Shh. So, I downloaded the Bitstrip app. And Dude, look at Amber. That's me. And my girlfriend, Crystal. <laughs> we could tell. I gotta have a picture of that. Dude, you look at look at the hair. You can tell because Crystal has those atrocious bangs. And look at Amber. You can see her shape. And... I put this picture up because I thought it was hilarious. That's pretty much our relationship in a sentence. No, not really. I'm joking. But I just thought it was really funny. I think it's more accurate than you because realize. Because I'm obsessed with cats and that's usually the face she makes when I mention such a thing. So yeah, I just thought that was really funny. Just had really some funny. leftover Thanksgiving food. Not really following plan like I thought I would, but... I was oh, well. surprised. Why do you look so cute, Smokes? Smoke. Why? Oh, did I interrupt you? What are you doing? Tired? Alright, I'll leave you alone. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come back. Uh, are you recording right now? Uh-uh. You're over a thousand views. Thank you, everybody. That makes me happy. Dude. Come back. Uh, are you recording right now? Uh-uh. That face, that just, dude, it never ceases to amaze me. Her eyes just look so blank. You're over a thousand views. Thank you, everybody. That makes me happy. A thousand views makes you happy? Dude, I, I get that. It makes me happy, too. My, my content is so fantastic. You guys should just give me those views. Maybe you guys are the asshole and not me. I hope it's very, very obvious that was a joke. That was a joke. Anyone out there, any keyboard warriors settled down. It was a joke. Yep. <laughs> I cannot believe it. Thank you. Monkey laying on my lap. Um, currently updating my iPod that I have not done in forever. Yeah, this is a very old iPod. I only bought it. I bought it used, by the way, and I only bought it because I needed to hold more music because I have so much, but I put this on the front of it and this on the back of it just to kind of spice it up a bit. I don't know. It was kind of just like a fun thing to do. And then my girlfriend... Super childish. She did this to her iPod because I was doing it to mine. I gave this to her. Yes, I'm so sweet. I knew it's an iPod Touch and I gave it to her. She put some stickers that are like Japanese in those. <laughs> yeah. We were just being silly that day. But yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I like being little kids. I currently have 1,289 songs on my iTunes and on that's my it? iPod. I used to um, only use my phone for music, but since now... I do nothing but film, it takes up a lot, a lot of space, so I have no room for music anymore. Not complaining. I do miss my music though, because with this iPod, I can't play music out loud like I would on my phone, but oh well. What do you mean out loud? If you are new around here, thank you for taking the time to check out the channel and the video. I do appreciate you. If you are one of my OGs, you guys already know how I feel about each and every one of you bitches out there. I fucking love you guys. Don't forget to become a locked out cholo just like myself through my official channel memberships. I appreciate you guys sticking it out with me through that one. Like I said that was a, a longer video. Thank you for making that ride with me. I do appreciate you guys. Now with that, I will see you guys in the next one.